slips off and doesn't check out, so. Hmm. Yeah, I would not be surprised if this is like, you know, a long match. Even if it's like 2-0 in anyone's favor, you can see it, you know, going down like five minutes a game. I think, I think she's going for a button check. Oh, no, never mind. I don't know. Either way, we'll see. Yeah, button check, okay. What's really interesting, you didn't know, Pac-Man's up air sends him like up a little bit. So mm -hmm. what you can do is that you can fall through the platform just a little bit and then do an up air and you'll fall back on top of the platform. Yeah, I've seen that. Pac-Man's up air is weird. Pac-Man's a fun character, honestly. Oh, yeah. I think they're giving us a preview of what we're going to see in the next in the match. What we didn't actually know is this is actually the this is actually like the actual <laughs> set. We just camp it out this hard. <laughs> Grand finals at Evo. This is all you see. That'd be that'd be it'd be hard to watch. I won't lie. <laughs> Not as bad as the meal. That was I don't know. That was good. I enjoyed it. <laughs> Like, I thought it was really funny, but you know, it's not a good way to end Smash Four, though. I thought that was, a, I thought that was a perfect way, but I'm into weird stuff. <laughs> anyway, this, yeah, I think we're finally done with this button check. Alright, yeah, T is prepping himself right now. I can see it. You gotta mentally prepare. You like, all right, 20 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> Start the clock. <laughs> Here comes that three-game set. Yeah, that three-game, eight-minute set, uh -huh. four minutes between every game because you got to really think about it, digest it. Hit him with that frame 18. <laughs> we look at my hero's back here with that. But, yeah. yeah. That's what I like to see from these players, like mentally prep them and stuff. Mm -hmm. That's so important for Smash. A lot of people are like, oh, you just got to have, have that tech skill. Like, if your mentality is off, you can re definitely tell in your play you're just not as confident. So you really need to make sure you get your mentality in check. You can get torn apart by players who have a better mentality than you. Yeah. Right now, we got to see the preview because that's exactly what we're seeing right now. And here comes the follow-ups with that Frisbee. And he almost got the can confirm on him. Yep. The can a little too many holes in it. A lot of things coming out right now. He's able to get away with it, that dash pack. And what else I also hate about Duck Hunt is that it manipulates the camera. Mm -hmm. Oh, no. What no a great... I don't believe he's dead. No, he oh, is. my God. It was a really good edge guard set up by T. He was able to hit him with those bears over and over again. And it forced down air dodge. Yeah, I didn't realize he didn't have a jump there. 40 I Gallic Yeah, Gallica combos. That's where Pac-Man gets his big boy damage. I blinked for a second. And we already got 54 already on Nintendo. He's got some trouble going his way. He's sending up camp, but he is, is able to find those one projectile hits and then find a way to combo into it. Yep, right now T is looking fully in control, especially after that first dock. But it's that fair into the can. Really cute conversion. Oh, get that can out of here. Yeah, no, T is literally not afraid to kick that can away. He does not care at all. And here comes the bell once more. You gotta be yep. careful. Yep, but the uh, yeah, but the frisbee, you know, also gonna trade out. And uh, Nintendo obviously, you know, pressing it again so he can get that extra hit stun. So there's no way that T could actually get that, uh, get the punish out. He's got the bill once more. He's gonna throw it out. It actually stuns it out so for so much damage, but, but only gets the fair and gets the weak back air too. Uh -oh. It's gonna be really difficult to come back from. Yep. If just goes for the orange. Yep, kicks him right in the jaw. That's like a snake down air. That's the, that's the. Yeah, Pac-Man's down air. Yeah, definitely got buffed from four. Back in, uh, back in four, it wasn't the greatest move, but now it actually has a decent amount of knockback. You know, it's, it's looking really strange right here because Nintendo, it's his cans right now, but he's making it look like it's his own projectile. Tease, give me that. Yeah. <laughs> give what it a here, read. Give it, here, give it here. And 73, once again, forced off in this offstage position. T is not afraid to contest these cans or aerials from... Yeah, T's just like, he, he doesn't care. He's in his own world. He's already up two stocks or three stocks to one, but finally getting that stock off with the can. nintendo has got a long road ahead of himself. But if he wants to do it, he's going to have to sit down, buckle up, and uh, get some damage in. And there's definitely one thing you don't want to see is that your own Good tech. Aerials, yep, he's able to hit him out. And great tech for both players to get away from it. But T, looking really confident. He's going to go for either a bell and just going to go for a smash setup. Mm -hmm. Yep, blocking the bell, though. Hey. Pac-Man going to re-grab it again, going to throw it. There we go, but gets that double uh, that double projectile lineup too. Goes for the F smash read, but we're getting double frisbee up air. Not gonna kill yet though. Here it comes right now. He's in a little dangerous position, but right now using that fire hydrant to wall him out. 
He's treating the fire engine like a can, essentially. He's throwing mm -hmm. it out there as a wall. He's able to shield it out. He knows he has the advantage. Unable to find a convert. It actually canceled out the key that's massive for Nintendo to stay alive. Exactly. Well, goes for the down smash, but actually oh. hit the other direction. Wait a minute. Mm -hmm. All right, Nintendo's finally got those two stocks, but oh, gets that back air. Yeah, gives him, give him the boot. Him. JV2 coming in for T. Nintendo was still, like we said, he got those two stocks off. He was down 3-1. to one, Put it down to a 1-1 one, one deficit, but unfortunately it was a little too far too late. It was at the point where T just needed to get a good hit, and it, he got it. It was that first stock that kind of spelled the entire game when T was able to get that edge card and force out the Yeah, direction. he got that stock so early, sub 40%. It was when Nintendo, like, finally was able to slow down the game to his own pace where he was able to fight back, but at that point it was just too late. Exactly. And also, T is playing fearless against Duck T, <laughs> T does not care about whatever stuff you're throwing out, because I'll throw it out and too. He's like, that can is mine. Give me that, uh, yeah. Why don't, you, why don't you put that over my way? Like, that Frisbee would be mine if I, could, if I could catch that, you know? Exactly. So going into game two, going to run it back to PS2. So let's see if Nintendo again can hold his own, not really lose that stock as early, because if that didn't, you would have thought that would have been a lot closer for a match. You could think that. Yeah, but it's T, right? He's not going to let you get away with it. And here come the up air strings coming in, 37%. Yeah, T's not going to give you any freebies. If you give if you give him a, an ounce, uh, an inch, he'll take it a mile. And he's able to get the Galaga right now. This camera looking extra sus for that fan get in the way, but... Oh, there we go. That frame one frisbee catching him, catch him out of that grab. You have to get him out of it. Here comes the fire hydrant once more. Yep, trying to hit the Hydrant, but the bad thing about that is that you're focusing your time on the Hydrant. You give Pac-Man a little bit of time to set up, and you really just want to suffocate Pac-Man as much as you can so he can't throw out all these things and just confuse you. And I like that I like that play from T. He, is, he did the one-two jab and then immediately ran away knowing he has to respect it. And that actually, the Fire Hydrant is getting canceled out. I like that Nintendo's throwing out the arrows to, to uh, clash with it in order to avoid the damage. And he's doing a really good job because this is an entirely different Nintendo. Here we go, goes to the ledge trap. I really like that get up attack. So you didn't have to worry about the can being there. And I don't think Nintendo was expecting it either. Has Pac-Man at 140%, goes to a tick grab setup, but just gonna roll out of time in the nick of time. And get away with it. Here comes the bell once more, but I'm able to find anything. Nintendo is doing such a great job walling it out, but T, he's got something else to say, forcing him off stage. Yeah, but now we have Duck Hunt off the ledge. I like the up air to get rid of the Hydrant. It's so hard. You can see Nintendo wants his kill and he's so close to it. But uh, T, he's putting up this defensive mind style, but gets caught on that second platform, gets an up air. The first, uh, what's the word? Advantage? First Lead, stop. there we go. Oh, but oh what an air dodge. As soon as you said that, T is just like, I heard you think that he has an advantage. I'm going to take that right back. And but you said what now? Uh-huh. I'm taking curse company right oh now. Oh, my, my God. God. 55, damn, 65. Damn, what's his damage? 76 coming in just like that. We don't even know what just happened. There was he got hit by the Galaga, the Can, then Pac-Man. That was so much. got the star. T is on fire right now. Like I said, don't. Don't give T a, don't give T a single ounce because look, look what happened, bro. He, he got that entire stock just because he threw out the Can. Don't, he's not letting him breathe. Like You're talking about how T needs to be suffocated in order for Nintendo to win. But it seems that T is going to be the one doing all of that stuff. And right now, he's getting so much damage off that. Down and forcing him off again. And right now, this is like a repeat of game number one because we're seeing the exact same percents. And that stock advantage is in T's favor. And he's got the smash attack with his name on it. God, T is so good. I love that. T is so good. Once he gets an advantage, he starts feeling himself. He's able to just condition you into doing these panic options, and then he's able to whip punish you so well. He 